Hello, my beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Blanquita Styles, and I'm here with my girl Mona Elderisi. And before we continue, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Like that, you will be notified as soon as one of my videos is released. So today I'm doing something completely different, and I have a guest with me. Hi. Say hi, Mona. Hi. <laughs> So tell us a little bit about yourself. I am studying to become a chef. Mm -hmm. I'm in cooking school. I work as a food stylist for uh, restaurants, different food brands. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And also the great thing is that she's also joined the team as a Monet partner with me and her hair transformation has been unbelievable and she's doing absolutely great and today we just figured why not try a nice little experiment so here we go today we are here because we've been seeing how would you say like a challenge or more like a test yeah a test. yeah more like a test an experiment to see how aerosol products and what they contain. And we're gonna show you all the products and we're gonna see if these ones will catch on fire and the Monet ones might not catch on. No. Are not supposed on fire because they are non toxic, vegan, um, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, exactly. They're not supposed to catch on fire. So let's start the experiment. Okay. This one, the Pantene Pro V. And you will do the honors. Oh my god, I'm so scared! Okay, three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> what? Um, we're discovering things here. Okay. How about Tresemme? I mean, it's supposed to be highly flammable. I don't understand why this is not working. Oh, oh, you saw it a bit. Okay, so Tresemme, guys. I mean, you saw what I saw, right? Yeah. You don't want that in your hair. Your hair will catch on fire. Mate. This is a spray shine from Oasis. So this is actually like more of a professional product. So let's see what happens with the spray shine. Okay, let's keep it away from my face. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this has like an explosion. <gasps> this is a professional product. Oh my god. Ex Extremely flammable. <laughs> flammable. Yeah, so we know that this one is true. Okay, I'm like, let's try this dry shampoo. So this dry shampoo is the Baptiste and it's Canada's number one dry shampoo. Let's see how it stands with the explosion test. What about the explosion of fire test? Because we don't want an explosion. Keep the damn thing away from my face! <laughs> oh. Yeah. Canada's number one dry shampoo. Oh my god, I felt the heat from that, eh? Mm -hmm. That's crazy. So, <laughs> you gotta spray this at your roots, imagine. All right, so let's see. Which one do you wanna try? Let's try the Dove hairspray, actually. <laughs> no, but I think you have to give it a good spray. Okay, okay, okay. Boom, there we go. Dove, this was style and so we have the Garnier Fructis hairspray. Let's see if this one is. Ooh. Oh my oh, god! Flamma, let's do some flambe. Okay, three, two. <laughs> I have to wash my blanket after. Let's try Sebastian. Yes. That is considered more high quality, more professional. So let's see what's going to happen with the spray. Let's go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Ready? yeah. Oosh! Very flammable. So I'm actually very surprised that the higher end, two out of the higher end products, so the Oasis, which is professional from Schwarzkopf, and Sebastian, which is also considered professional, were the most flammable. Food for thought. Provana's also a professional brand, and this is the Extreme Hold, so let's see what happens. Oh. And this is supposed to be vegan and gluten-free, but it was still Flammable. Redken wax spray. Let's see how this goes out. <laughs> how, 
how hard you push the button. <laughs> oh my god, and how much hairspray I have on my legs. <laughs> oh my god, no. So now we know. And so Uma. maybe we should do the Pantene again. Okay. Let's check it out, check it out. <gasps> it burns the... The metal? The metal. I don't know if you guys can see this, but the metal is like flaming. Obviously with all this spray on it. <laughs> the moment of truth. Let's get a drum roll. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's start with the refinish. Yeah, so refinish control hair straight from Monate. Monate. Of course. Of course. Let's see. Nothing. And O to the thing. <laughs> Now we're gonna try their other hairspray. So this was the, that was the refinish. I don't know if you can see it. I'll take a picture of it and show you. So the refinish hairspray, which has a light to medium hold. It's perfect for like, you know, when you have curly hair, you could just put a few, or me when I did my ponytail for my little bang in the front, I just put on a bit and look at that beautiful shine that it also gives you. It's not very stiff. Then you have another one, which is the Strong Flexi Hold Hairspray. And this is more of a medium to stronger hold. And you can actually control how much hairspray you want out and the consistency of it. So let's give it a shot. Yep. Okay. Very good, we're happy so far, eh? It actually worked. <laughs> we didn't even do this before, right? Like Mona asked me, did you try it? And I said, no, because I actually wanted to see it for real. You know, I didn't want it to be a fake reaction. So, and this is the, the dry shampoo. It's amazing because it's made with rice starch. So let's check it out. Modern nature. So you see guys, it did work. So these hairsprays don't contain that harmful, chemical, toxic product that the other ones do contain. And we saw it ranging from the lowest quality brands, which are the cheapest ones, to the more professional ones, and they were still extremely flammable. So this is just to say, be careful what you put on your hair, be careful what you put on your skin, because your skin is your largest organ, and whatever you put on it gets absorbed immediately into your bloodstream. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Thank you so much, Mona, for You're being my welcome. partner. You can check her out on her Instagram. What's your Instagram, girl? Mona Al Idris. There you go, and you're gonna see upcoming photo shoots that we're gonna be doing together and a lot of projects on her side. And don't forget to check me out also, and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell like that. You'll be notified as soon as one of these videos is released. So take care and hope to hear from you soon. Ciao.